Hello here, so welcome back to just another dang how-to channel. So this is my first um, how-to video for the year. Uh, hope you guys had a great 2020. Anyway, so this video we're gonna learn how to install uh, Homebrew on um, ARM or the latest M1 chip. So Homebrew got updated. It now supports um, ARM and um, Intel chips um, and also the Linux version. So to get started, just go to brew.sh and you could grab the same installation script. So you copy that and then open your terminal and simply paste. It would prompt you for your system admin password. Let me just make this bigger. And saying it would install homebrew on this directory, opt forward slash homebrew. If you're using an Intel version, you would notice it would install on the user local directory. Um, so because I'm using M1, it's installing it on this directory. So I'll just hit uh, return. And it's gonna try to download and grab all the necessary files to install. So previously, um, when you tried to do this, um, it would ask you to install um, differently uh, because it wasn't supported. Then you ended up with two versions of Homebrew, one for uh, the Rosetta, which is emulating the Intel chip and then the actual uh, ARM version so this is now straightforward uh, there's only one version that will get installed you could still grab the old one if you like but that's outside the scope of this tutorial so just waiting for it to finish okay so the download has finished um uh, you would get this warning that's saying homebrew bin is not in your path so the next step is to uh, add the homebrew uh, bin executable into your path. So under the next step section here, simply copy these instructions and paste them again and hit enter. That should write the homebrew executable on your Z profile file. So if I try now brew help, it's now installed. Cool. So. If I do a brew list, you would see I have an empty list of um, applications that I've installed. I'm going to try to install Node. So to install Node, I just say brew install Node. So it's going to try to grab the library from the homebrew uh, repository. So if I do brew this now, you would see I have node and install uh, one of the dependencies of node. If I do node version, and I now have the latest version available for uh, homebrew on node. Cool. So that's the tutorial. It's really easy. Hope you like it. Uh, thumbs up if you like this video. Thumbs down if you don't. If you have some questions, leave them on the comments below. Cheers, bye for now.